So this is 6717 Nokomis. This is another one I added to the list since I figured I was on my way to Gallad, so I might as well do another one for you just so we can get a cross section of what's out there in the price ranges. So this is kind of the northeast side of town. On a map, it's near Palmer Park and Powers Road. So a buy level, as you can see, two car garage, parking on the side, a shed in the back, and another gate right there. All right, let's head in. All right, so we are inside. That's the upper level, lower level. We'll start the lower level. So immediately down the stairs, we got the laundry room, washer hookup, dryer hookup, dryer vent. Um, not sure what that is. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. It's the tankless water heater. Well, that's pretty nice. Furnace looks newer as well. That's kind of awesome. Yeah, so this is the laundry room. Storage underneath the stairs. Once again, the joy of finding. All right, so a deep freeze is out here. You've got the efficient furnace. That's what those white pipes are from the efficient furnace. Good size two car. You could definitely fit two SUVs, probably two big trucks in here. You got a sprinkler system back against that wall, the green thing. Good size garage. All right, so we go through this door. We come to a family room, or it could also be a bedroom, I imagine, because it's got the bathroom in it. So standard three quarter, but updated. The shower itself isn't updated, I don't think, but the vanity is and the tile. So it's a decent sized family room. Got a wood, no, gas fireplace. No, wood burning. Yeah, wood burning fireplace. Newer windows, newer window coverings. Yeah, so that's the basement. Let's quickly check upstairs and if I can find a light switch. Okay, it's out there. All right, so we'll head upstairs. All right, so since we're over here, might as well just check out the bathroom. All right, so we got an updated bathroom, updated tile, updated tub. Yeah, not bad. <clears throat> That's kind of a linen closet, as is this. So three bedrooms. I know you kind of wanted three bedrooms on the same level, if at all possible. And this one is going to be less expensive than, than Gallad would be. So I figured, what the heck, we're on the way there. Might as well just see it. This is a pretty good size bedroom. You could fit a queen in here. You wouldn't have a lot of extra room on the sides, but a queen would definitely fit, but a full size bed would be perfect for this room. And you got your master. Not the biggest master we've seen, but you got the dual, call it dual closets. I mean, it's a wardrobe, but you wouldn't need a dresser. So you got the closet there. Yeah, interesting setup. So you got the closet. So this is the original closet. And these wardrobes, they just put in just for more space. So a queen would fit here, but wouldn't have a ton of room for anything else. Then updated sink, bathroom. So the master's not very big. And that's, you know, that's kind of the situation there. All right, let's go look at the kitchen. Then we'll head on to Gallad, the one that you were really wanting to see. So 
So we got Corian counters, and that's a countertop, I'll tell you what. That's a nice kitchen. So your family room would be right there with nice mountain views out the window. Can't really see it because of the lighting. You could put some bar stools here, dinner table there. These look like new appliances. I knew just about everything. Then you got a park behind the house. Well, that's kind of nice. So you got a park back behind the house. You got a good sized deck with Trex decking. Neighbors have a lot of sheds. One thing you'll never change is your neighbors. But you'll never have neighbors behind your house. Just to, those neighbors look like they're, they keep everything really nice. Nice fire pit. Those neighbors have a lot of stuff. Yeah. Okay, so that's the house. I don't have a lot of time to spend too much time there, but that's why I do videos. So you can go back and look at it over and over and over. Okay. But, I mean, ooh, that's kind of cool. Double ovens. Nice gas stove. Dishwasher. The microwave. Fridge. So, got everything you need in the kitchen. And then, nice view of Pikes Peak. Oh, yeah. And then you can see the neighborhood as well. All right, on to the last one.